is going on guys? My name is Rama back again from Rowan Reviews here with another episode of Reaction 2. We never learn no Boku Ben. This is going to be episode 5, A Genius in the Forest Strays for X. I'm really want- hold on, I'm going to go look at these plot synopsis because I'm trying to figure out what's going to happen this episode. So, since you're not- since people in the- if I'm ever featured in a compilation, I'm not spoiling anything. Uh, Ichinose Academy's famous three-day, two-night study training camp has begun. Naruyuki and the students study hard at the boarding house in the mountains, but Rizo can't stop thinking about her tutor. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I'm still waiting. Hold on. Make sure to watch after credits for Best Girl. <gasps> Are we all? Are we gonna get Asumi? Let's find out. Alright, guys. Let us jump in to Boku Ben or We Never Learn Episode 5 starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Got my beer. And I'm ready to I'm ready to see this trip. But yeah, no, the someone was actually saying that like Takemoto was best girl and like like she's leaps and bounds above all that. Um and she and they were curious as to why I liked an or or how good a, my favorite girl is. I mean, it's all down to personal taste, in all honesty. But, me personally, I'm not going to spoil it, but my favorite girl kind of just, like, hits most of the things that I like in terms of, like, waifu material. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm definitely not helping my weebness. Everyone has their taste. I mean, I know a lot of people still like Takamoto, but the biggest consensus with this community, um, with this show, or the series, is, if you've read the manga, um, uh, the sensei is best girl. And I think so too, but it takes a long time for her to get going. I'm so, like, all the girls are getting, like, really good in-depth, in-depth, uh, in-depth, like, little character-focused chapter slash chapters. Like, Furuhashi, I loved her chapter, spoiler, about why she, okay, this actually, I'm gonna be really subtle in it, but why she, uh, why she likes the stars, and then a situation with her father. I love that. That was one of, uh, actually, like, bumped her up in ratings. Takamoto has actually dropped the lowest in terms of how the manga is going, the series, simply because, like, she's not getting a lot of screen time. Um, she is, but she's not getting a lot, like, she's not getting the development like the other characters are. Even Ryuzu has gotten a good development, but by far, Ki um, Kirisu Sensei is by far the most developed one Probably by now. Although the last latest chapters of uh, Best Girl have been great. Awesome, me. I'm waiting for you to. I'm waiting for you to show up. By the way, reaction compilations. Apparently, Best Girl is going to appear at the end. Don't leave it out. There she is. Mm. Purple-haired waifu. Cause you know that's totally natural. Man, it sucks. I love all these. Like, these intros are great. It just, ever since I've watched Kaguya-sama, it just hasn't been the same. Kaguya-sama, I think, has, is still by far my favorite opening of this year. Because your heart goes doki-doki. <laughs> Rizu, I, I I do like Rizu though. Like all the girls in this show are top tier. That's a very small razor. You know, maybe get the ones on the back of your pencil. Or you know, just be nice. That's how some people think. Oh wow, that person gave it to her. Gave it to him. What a nice girl. You done goofed. 
<laughs> that freaking pout. How the fuck do you drop that? With those tan lines, though. <laughs> is that some jealousy I'm sensing, Rizu? Yes, it is. It's funny because she. I think she's. I think she's like really tiny. I forgot. Like I think they actually did the measurements for her, and it's in centimeters. And I'm a filthy American guy gene, so I had to convert it to feet and inches. But I think she's like five two. I'm six two. I'm an entire foot taller than her. If that's the case, and that's pretty damn short. That that's the one thing about Rizzo. Rizzo has those uh, chibi moments that I thoroughly enjoy. Rejected. Wow, Sayonara! You're gonna give her the you're gonna give him the Sayonara. Not even the uh, John A or anything like. That. Wow, I'm sounding such like a fucking weeb. You know, well, she said sayonara, and that... Hold on, where's my glasses? I don't have my glasses. They're downstairs. Well, she said sayonara, and that kind of means goodbye, like long-term goodbye. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm calling myself out for my Nippon 7 -ness. It's the beer talking. I swear. It's okay. You become kind of best... Oh, hey. Kind of good, good, good earth girl. See, it's actually, it would be actually hard. If someone were to give me, like, a list of, like, for most harem-based shows, like, who's their least favorite girl, I can usually give, like, ah, easy. This one? Get, no. Like, Gotoba no Hanayome. Worst girl, Itsuki. Even in the, even in the manga, she's kind of, like, the lowest tier. Frickin' Nisekoi. Ooh, who would be worst girl? Uh, the fucking... Older sister slash teacher. She was the worst girl to me. But in... with, We never learn? Yeah, that doesn't apply. Because literally every single girl is great. Even the fucking side character that we got last episode was damn... Is damn good because she got her own s chapter and I'm like, yeah, if she wasn't in the role for... If she wasn't in the run for Yuiga Bowl, I'd go for her. Uh, Sen... The girl, the girl that wants to be friends with Rizu. Starts with an S. I was about to say Sekiro, but that's not <laughs> the right thing. Speak of the fucking devil. <laughs> Seki Joe. That's right. Seki, I was thinking Sekiro, Seki Joe. Okay, I was close. I ship it. It should be like that, because Yuri is love, Yuri is life. And that was the last time you saw her. You know, funny thing is, I don't remember this in the manga. Which is kind of good, because this is some, uh, quote-unquote, breath of fresh air. For lack of a better word. In fact, honestly, most of this trip, I don't really remember the majority of this trip. Fifty-five alive. She looks like a lost puppy. It's weird, I don't really remember this in the manga much.
She does have cute moments, so that's like I think she has. I don't know, like she has the cutest moments for when it turns to care um, personality swap. Like some moments, like it, it, like for example, like some characters will be like super serious, but then they'll have a cute side to her. Or them. She fits that role perfectly, where she'll have moments of like, well, because I mean, look at her. She has a very deadpan kind of face for the most part. But she'll have moments where she gets flustered and all that. She has, like, her, she has the biggest, like, from normal to cute moments, I guess. If, if, yeah. I know it's hard to explain. Forgive me. She is a lost child. I'm actually going to turn up a little bit on my end. It's a little low. Ah, uh, yes. The stereotypical trope of I'm going to stand up and fall. And you know what? I love it every single time. Why? Because... Oh, that's right. I forgot about this scene. <laughs> Good job. You you reach first base. Right? That is the bases, right? Yeah, you reach first base. Here's a toast to you, Nariyuki. <laughs> it's a sign. It's weird. I don't remember her having like this kind of like brotherly complex. <laughs> They're getting scolded. Look like at fucking Reese's face. Look at that face. Look at that fucking face. I yeah. You know. Now I'm starting to remember just that scene though. I still don't remember the majority of of um of what happened. But I do remember that kiss scene. Let her reminisce. Let her brew within her. Let her remember that kiss. It was. <laughs> well, okay, hold on. Did it count to you, though? I mean, don't worry, you're, there's plenty more that's going to happen. I think. I wonder if they're going to animate some scenes. I swear, I really hope they do. It's because she's Doki Doki. Let me see that blush face. Let me see it, 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 let me see it. Let me see it. Where's my glasses? Where's my glasses? I need to see this in high definition. I, I'll make this work. Hold on. Hold on. I will make this work. They're gay. I need to clean him really quickly. Why would you do this to me? This. The best way to do it? Pretend you. Don't know and just continue to clean. 
literally, you want to know how many times you could just solve a problem? Like, By the way, we were cleaning here. Sorry. Never make that face again. Ass. It's supposed to be fucking hot. I love saunas too. Sweet mother of God, brace. Embrace me. Also, 10 lines, 10 out of 10. Is I is he underneath the bench? I don't I, like I said, I don't really remember this. You This is going to be... I... <laughs> oh, man. Oh, my gosh, she's fucking dead. <laughs> you make that sound like that's a bad thing. He's gonna die, Nariyuki. I'm actually thinking you can take me. See I'm actually surprised he can actually see you with those glasses if you think about it. Yep, yeah. I forget, yeah, because she loves, she loves the stars. She's so good. She's so good. I love her character. Seki Joe is great though. I I know we're not even gonna come close to seeing it, but but her own little chapter is pretty damn great too. Are you sure about that? Oh god, I thought it was gonna be, I thought it was gonna be a sensei, and I was gonna. Oh my Jesus. Don't yo. <laughs> I do. Okay. That water looks slightly discolored. I do really wish we got more of her in the manga, but she she really gets sidelined.
I've seen enough Iramanga Sensei. To, I've seen Iramanga Sensei four times. I I know where this is going. I've had to see it four times for those videos. So getting that sweet ass girls. I'm still waiting. Apparent, like I said, everyone says at the end we're gonna see best girl. Well, it's been quite eventful. My dog's barking. Sorry if you can pick that up. You say that now. You say that now. It's really not. <laughs> I drank out of that. See, that's this is why I do like, I like this is this is a very like I know it's a light-hearted show, and it doesn't really have that many serious moments. It like it does get like its serious moments, but it's more like for like a chapter or two, and then it kind of like lessens up. Uh, I think Furuhashi's is probably the most like. I think Furuhashi's dedicated chapter, or chapters, probably had the most like. A long effect of like it just being really serious the entire time. But yeah, I heard. I, I you you have no idea how badly I want to skip past this outro just to see it. I want to see Asami. I want to see Asami. Come on, just show me, show me, show me best girl. Show me best girl. Show me a lolly senpai. I do. I that would be really cool if Seki Joe actually like pl plays a bigger character, but it's coming near the end of the show. You can feel it in the writing. Um, so yeah. All right, here it is, guys. Here it is, guys. We're gonna see her. We're gonna see her. That beautiful goddess. Let me see her, let me see her, let me see her, let me see her, let me see her. Oh. This is what you're talking about for best girl? I mean, Kirisu Sensei is great. She is actually, she is best girl, so let me see this. I'm, I'm actually, I'm looking forward to this. Best girl. That's a loaded question on that one. Oh, that's right! <laughs> that, so that means we're probably not going to get Asami until maybe episode 8. Maybe episode 7? Possibly. By the way, that screenshot right there, that freeze frame is nice too. They're also 16, so I should probably like uh, chill a little bit. Because that's like 8 years younger than me. So that's possibly, I should probably just... Not say that and keep that on the DL, but apparently I'm already creepy. 
Uh, yeah, let's uh, move on from this one. But anyways, guys, that was a great episode. That was fun. You can see why, like, like I didn't, I totally forgot that Sekijo did what she did. And that makes me appreciate her that much more. Because, like I said, Sekijo is a character that is sidelined very hard. Well, for, sideline pretty hard. I mean, there's not many side characters. Even, like, if you're talking about, like, s characters that got completely sidelined, look at Naruki's, like, bro friends. They're not in the picture much at all, besides maybe, like, a cameo here and there. But, yeah, um, I'm really, like, looking forward to when we see Asami, who, in my opinion, is going to be... I don't know how much they're going to develop her in this show, but... I loved her. Like, she was my best girl up until Kirisu Sensei got her arc, and I'm like, damn it, you're best girl. I'm sorry, you're great. Even her, like, little standoff, like, chapters were great. Every single time I saw him, I was like, this is great. But yeah, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm gonna go wrap this up now, uh, and I'm gonna be done with reacting. I'm probably gonna go, like, probably just lay down and relax for a little bit. But yeah, I've thoroughly enjoyed this. Hopefully you guys have too. Um, but yeah, we're not going to get who Mama I liked the most, for the most part, up until maybe episode 7 or 8. Which is a shame, because we're not going to get much development. So, like I said, for the time being, I did think Takamoto was best girl for the longest time. And even, like, during, like, when I think she was one of the first few ch um, girls who get her own dedicated chapter. And I was like, there's no way that another girl can beat her. They did. Especially Kirisu Sensei. And then Asami. And then actually, I think Furuhashi actually is right next. Furuhashi is number three. And then honestly, it is still a toss up between Rizu and Takamoto in terms of best girl. Because there's really only five. I mean, Sensei's most likely not going to win. So it comes down to the main three. And it, okay, so this is kind of going to support the territory, but it feels like Takamoto's kind of out of the race. It feels like it. They could prove me wrong. But. But. It does seem like they're leaning heavily towards Furuhashi. And, I, you know, I wouldn't be mad. And honestly, if any of these girls won, I would not be mad. I would prefer one over the other, but it is what it is. But anyways, guys, I've gone on for too long. I'm going to go out, hurry up and upload this. So, guys, without further ado, I don't know why I said that. Like, I'm starting the show. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.